Hey guys, what's up? Will here, and today we are back inside of Doodle World for the Doodle World One Youth Doodle Tournament. We are joined with Average Person and Ender. We're gonna have to see whether this fight will be below or above average. Hopefully, it gets quite close. But comment down below who you want to win and who you think will win. Hopefully, it's the same there, but you never know. Before we see their teams and get on with the fight, let me just explain what this is. One use means you can only use each doodle once. Once in a team, and after you use it in one team, you can't reuse it in other teams. So if I use a bun suite in my first team, can't use it in second team, and I can only use it once in my first team. So now you know that. Let's get into the fight. Pronos and Kandagon match up. Drain life, but unfortunately the Kronos is slower, so doesn't really help this term. Kanagon did some beefy damage to Kronos there, leaving it on one hit. Surely the Kronos is going to switch out here, right? Never mind. Restores a little bit of health, but not enough. Kronos dies there to a Kanagon, meaning that Kronos was definitely wasted. Polar Geist is then sent out. Okay. Frost Grip almost kills. But it doesn't. Surprise that Polar Geist didn't use a spirit move there. Would have been super effective. Uses Frost Grip on the Clanging Tang though. Gets all right damage off. Not too much though. Puts the Clanging Tang to sleep. Hopefully they set up here and do not attack. If they attack, then they've just wasted that. Okay, yeah, they switch. Easy switching. That also works. Earth on Earth. All right. Tang Tang wakes up. But Tang Tang is faster, so couldn't do anything. Puts itself to sleep here. Not very smart, seeing as... Seeing as the monologue just got it down one hit anyway. High roll plus crit probably could have killed the Glangutang one shot there. But it's fine. Stays asleep and then dies. Yeah, anime. That that was poor. Spear Ice is then sent out. Does Spear Ice have any like cell moves? Because like Frost Grip, yeah. It's super effective, but it does like no damage because pre-evolution. Pre-evolutions are only really good in this if they can set up somehow. Okay. Not good damage at all. But Monologue's move does miss. Who's in the back of this guy's team? Uh Oh, he brought Spirisol and Spirayu. I did not see that before. That is very dumb. Not gonna lie. Um... Monologue keeps boosting his defense and lowering his attack. Spear Ice was probably the best bet for taking this out, but just does no damage. I don't think there's anything on his team that would have a water or plant move either, so... I think this Monologue might be GG for anime. Not going to be doing too much damage, but it will be taking even less damage itself. Pummel does no damage. The used crowns is giving it more health back. Right, and the Spirayu does die there. Is he going to send in the Spirasol here? That's what I'm going to guess. Yep, Spirasol. Uses Flurry. And... Mm, this is not looking too good for anime. Not good at all. Uh, if that Spear Ice was Polar Geist, this game would have been perfect for anime. I really do not see why Spirosol and Spirayu are both in the same team, though. Ender also made a fat mistake early on, wasting their Kronos. <laughs> Spirosol keeps using Flurry, even though it does no damage. Does he not have a special attack on any of these? Who's left? Bunswell? And what else? Because I know he's brought out Kandagon and Clangy Clang. I believe in you, anime. 
Yes, glaze punch. Crit still does no damage. <laughs> oh, dies the turn it sent in. Right, what's left? Is this Candate gone? Yeah, Candate gone. But on 3 HP. It's GG here. Unless anime can bring it back with something crazy. It's the end. Actually, Monologue Flint, it's just gonna gain health, though, so. Doesn't really matter. But, you know. And then Kandagon dies. Alright, GG. Anime is eliminated. And Ender moves on to the next round. Going on to the quarterfinals. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Comment down below who you think is going to win this whole tournament. Are you on Team Ender? Or someone else? Make sure to let me know. But until next time, goodbye guys.